Hi, Dave Lennox here with a few tips on your new Lennox heat pump. Now please remember that your heat pump will go through a defrost mode. While your heat pump is heating the house, the condensing unit outside will gradually frost up. Now there is a sensor that will recognize this and ask it to defrost. It will pause from heating the house, reverse the heat out into itself, defrost and drop some condensation. This is one of the reasons that it sits up on the stand. During this defrost mode, it'll make a different noise as the compressor and refrigerant reverse direction. This is a time when your furnace may turn on to help out the heat pump during heat pump operation temperature. When it has completed the defrost mode, the heat pump will go back to heating your home. In winter operation, keep your Lennox heat pump clear of snow at all times. If you find that your system is not providing any heat or cooling at all, try the following. Ensure that your thermostat is on heat mode. Ensure that the temperature is set warmer than what the temperature reads in the house. Check your air filter. If your air filter is dirty, it will not be allowing enough air to pass, and the heat pump and furnace will turn off on the safety high limit switch. The circulation fan may continue to run, but no heat is being produced. After changing the air filter, you'll need to turn the furnace service switch off. It should be mounted up high close to your furnace. It'll look like a light switch, but it'll turn off all power to the furnace and thermostat. Leave the switch off for at least five minutes. Turn the switch back on and wait for 10 to 15 minutes as the system will need to go through a reset procedure. If this was the issue, the heat pump will turn on the next time there's a call for heating or cooling and begin its next cycle. If it's winter and you go through this procedure and it has not solved the problem, go outside and have a look at the heat pump. There are a couple of climate issues that could affect the heat pump. If the temperature has been below minus four Celsius and it snowed, there could be a buildup of snow on the blades. Now this scenario could progress with snow and melting and freezing combinations to develop a heavy layer of frost and or ice on the blades or motor that may or may not be visible. If this is the case, turn off the service switch to initiate the reset procedure. Ensure the thermostat is in the heat mode, turn the service switch back on after five minutes, and then pour a bucket of hot water over the top of the heat pump, ensuring that the majority of the water hits the fan blade. Wait the required 10 to 15 minutes if this was the issue, the heat pump will turn on and begin its next heating cycle. If you've tried the homeowner's troubleshooting tips and still do not have success, call Interior Plumbing and Heating and request a service technician. 372-3441.